What's up with you? This is Orban and welcome back to my beautiful, beautiful home here in Stockholm, Sweden. And it's currently, uh, the, the sun is setting, uh, the, it's the sunset, the sun is setting, I don't know, uh, whatever. Uh, I don't know if it's blue or not. Hello, here I am. Anyways, uh, somewhat a special video, we're doing a sort of a recap of the live stream I had, the Q&A session, where you could ask anything, and I mean you asked anything, you asked about dick sizes and you asked about uh, python snakes uh, the average size of those you asked about uh, my my gaming background my youtube background my my everything so it was a bunch of fun and i had a blast and hopefully we will be able to do it again we will we will be able to do it again jeez i'm talking way too fast for myself uh, but anyways, it's currently Tuesday evening and I'm about to go to sleep then go to work and then uh, tomorrow then upload this video so we got to see this tomorrow just Thought you would know, man. Now you know. But uh, anyways, my question to you guys is, on Friday, this is sort of a special thing. I'm going to be live streaming, and I'm going to be doing a drinking game. So whenever I do something, I'm going to be drinking, okay? So it's, and this is kind of the, uh, the question for you guys. What do you want me to drink to? Do you want me to drink to whenever I kill somebody, whenever I die, whenever I get a kill streak? You know, if I drink to every time I kill somebody, then, you know, I might be uh, drunk within the hour. Uh, but, you know, I'm thinking about going for a while, so, you know, that might not be the best uh, best way. But I saw um, Sandy Ravage. Sandy Ravage did one where, where he took shots every time he got one shot for AC-130 and two shots for a nuke. And he played, like, three games in a row and got nukes and AC-130s all, all, game, all, all the games through. So I'm thinking about doing something like that, but I'm not going to be doing shots, I think. I'm, I'm feeling more of in, I don't know, I'm feeling in the mood for drinks on Friday. So I might be, you know, uh, mixing up some drinks and drinking that. But in the comment section below, I'm way, I've been doing this way too long now. But in the comment section below, let me know what you guys want to see. Do you want, do you want to see, do you want to see me drink to every nuke, to every uh, shopper gun or whatever it may be? Uh, please uh, let me know and I'll, I'll uh, try to... Uh, I'll try to make it happen. So in the comment section below, uh, do enjoy the video. Uh, it's actually some really funny questions in there. So stay tuned, comment section below, and I'm out. Bye! All right. Um, Bill Keys asked, what type of hair gel do you use? Ooh. Uh, I don't use hair gel. I use hair wax. Is, I don't know. You did that. Hair wax. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Yeah, hair wax. And I use uh, DFI Green. That is the uh, that is a really strong hole on that one, and uh, one of my pr pr proudest uh, possessions in life is my hair. So, I like to I like to take care of my uh, my hair, and uh, therefore, I want the best of the best, and therefore I choose uh, Defy Green. It's an awesome, right. awesome, awesome hair gel. So, boom! First question. A bit mainstream, but sure. Um, <laughs> <laughs> <shut up. laughs> uh, Reb I don't know if I pronounced that right. Oh uh, my god. Uh, he asked, uh, I like this girl. What do I do, bro? Uh, yeah, you obviously need to get her attention. That is the uh, that is the biggest. Uh, you, you obviously don't want to come at her like screaming or anything, but uh, you definitely want to get her attention. You don't you don't want to be nobody to her. So I would say, like, perhaps start off, uh, start off a, a quick conversation, like just uh, about random things, like perhaps not not the weather or anything like that, just anything that comes to mind, like if anything happens, like when you're uh, with her or whatever. If I don't know, there's a train crash, and then you could talk, talk about the train crash. You can be like, oh, that was terrible. And then you get a combo going, and uh, she will remember your name. Uh, Shocky asks, what's the best pickup line? Oh, that is, you, you walk up to a girl, uh, obviously as I said before, if you want to have a bigger success rate with any type of one-liners and uh, pickup lines or whatever, you want to of course um, get her attention first, you, you, you don't just want to walk up to her, like if you're at a club or a bar or anything, you want to like get eye contact or any like something like that before, but you just walk up to her, you walk up to her and uh, you're like, uh, you're going to look into her eyes and you're going to be like, yeah, um, I can't go to the airport anymore. And she's going to be like, what? Why? And you're going to be, well, because of these guns. Ooh, and then you're going to flex your biceps and she's going to be sold, baby. She's going to be sold. That is the best. That works. That works every time, baby. That works every time. <laughs> Shocky also asks, orb plus girl equals girl exploded? Question mark. Uh, that is true. That is absolutely true. 100%. You can't go wrong with that statement. 
uh, well orb what about the incident <laughs> uh, we're not gonna we're gonna we're not gonna be talking about the incident we're not gonna tell the whole fucking world about the incident man i'm not gonna not, i'm not gonna we're not gonna talk about the incident we're not gonna talk about the in- <laughs> incident man, yeah we're not gonna talk about the fucking incident we're not gonna no we're not gonna talk about the incident <laughs> there was no incident we're just rambling on there's there's nothing to be right, told new here. question. Yep. Here we go. Elder91991 asks, How long is your dick? Please, I really want to know and compare it to mine. Okay, so yeah, I get, I, I've gotten that question a lot, so I might just answer it like all in one. Um, I, I went to the doctors, and uh, they couldn't really figure out like how long it was. So they decided to just label it as a massive unit. So <laughs> that's, uh, that's how I look at it, and... Uh, you know, it's my burden to bear, and I'm, uh, I'm trying to live, live with it. Come on, die. I got hairs! Explains a lot about the incident. Yeah, <laughs> we're not gonna talk, don't bring up the incident, Jesus. Don't bring up the damn incident. There is no incident, nothing has been going on, revolving, um, anything. Beauty asks, what do you think of Alki David, or Alki David? Yeah, Alki David, uh, David, for Mary. those of you that... For those of you that don't know who Alki David is, uh, he is a billionaire who usually got involved with a lot of gamers uh, to create a gaming tournament. But he w- he was only in it for like I don't know. He he's a he's a weird guy. I don't know how to how to label him. He's a weird guy. Uh, he like in the in the live stream where they were presenting all the teams and whatnot, he showed he like took out a dildo and took out a lot of sex toys and uh, he said that a guy would take like commit suicide on live stream and uh, like on his network because. Um, he owns like filmon.com I think it's called and it's like a live streaming live streaming service and uh, he said that some guy from Ukraine was about to uh, commit suicide on live stream and it was paid for and everything by uh, Alki David but that was a big joke apparently and people didn't uh, didn't think that was a big joke <laughs> but yeah that, that is the story behind Alki David uh, to answer the question what do I think about him like I I don't know I don't really feel anything for him uh I, I, I didn't mind him bringing up all these sex toys. It doesn't really bother me that much. And uh, about the uh, assisted suicide, uh, you know, it's his choice if he, want, if, if he wants to commit suicide or not. So I, I wasn't really o- offended by that either. So I, I'm like, he, I don't know. He's a big troll. That, that's about it. I, that is all I have to say about Alki David. Okay. Boom. Uh, that, that was a long one. Sorry, I was speaking forever. <laughs> GG, guys. Uh, Sajik or something uh, asks, "What what's your goal in life, short term and long term?" Ooh, that that is actually a good one. Uh, the short term, but it's a, it's a very simple question, I would say. The short term, uh, uh, I don't know. The short term goal in life is to have as much fun as possible. I would say, uh, you know, I'm 20 years old now, and I'm um, going on 21. I don't know where I was going that, but like 20 to 25 is like the prime time of your life. So I want to have as much fun as possible. I don't want to like be committed to anything. Uh, I just want to have a bunch of fun. And when I'm 25, and I'm probably gonna say the same thing until I'm 30, and then the same thing until I'm 35. And apparently, before I know it, I'm 60, and I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna live life, man. I'm gonna <laughs> I just want to have fun. But uh, I don't know. the The short term, uh, short term goal is just to have a bunch of fun. And um, I don't know the long term, like get a family and all that jazz. I don't know. Talk about the incident. We're not gonna talk about the incident, guys. Seriously, <laughs> not at all. We're not. There was no incident involved regarding anything. There was no incident. Yeah, Redek asks, how important is GTL? GTL, Gym Town Laundry. It is very, very important. If you want to stay fresh, you want to stay. Uh, you you want to stay top notch. You you gotta do the GTL all day, every day, week out, week in, month. Uh, year, etc., etc. You gotta do your gym tan laundry. It's it is very important, and everything is combined. You can't just do the gym and tanning. Uh, you got, of course, gotta do the laundry as well. You gotta have fresh clothes. Uh, you gotta have a fresh tan, and you gotta be uh, you gotta be buff, man. So, uh, GTL is very very important. I would uh, advise all of you to get on it and go. Um, Genocide asks, how did you get into gaming slash YouTube? Um, okay, let's start with the first one. Jesus, long question is long. Um, <laughs> so, how did I get into... Uh, how did I get into gaming? Let's start with that one. Uh, how I got started... Oh, Jesus. How I got... St- uh, die! Thank you. How I got started... Uh, how I got started into gaming? Well, I uh, started playing... 
I would say like it all started with Nintendo 64 and Perfect Dark and GoldenEye when you played the uh, split screen four people multiplayers. I think it's uh, that was the time when it really started, and I got like a really competitive edge. I've I've always been competitive, but I think that really like escalated things, and I took it to a whole new level. And uh, after that, I started to play more games, and I started playing Counter Strike 1.5, like at the end of Counter Strike 1.5, in the beginning of 1.6. And I played like crazy. I played like a whole bunch. I've, uh, you know, you have this thing called social life. I skipped it entirely. I went all out on Counter Strike. Might not have been the best choice if you look back at it, but uh, yeah, you know, you, you can't uh, you can't regret too many things. <laughs> so yeah, okay. Let's. Uh, what's the other one? YouTube. Well, it also I played on this COD 4 server, and uh, I was doing fairly well, I would say. So people wanted me to post uh, tutorials on how to snipe. Yeah, pl- I just uploaded more and more content, and before you knew it, I had like 100 subs and 200 subs, 500 subs, and then like exploded out of nowhere. But uh, yeah, more and more people started uh, streaming in, and before you knew it, I had 1,000 subs, and now I'm at like 1.8. So. Uh, I'm having a blast with, with this whole thing, and hopefully you people are, uh, are enjoying the ride with me. And that is, uh, that is, that is my, uh, my, my, my YouTube history. What's the question? In the States, best memory. Yep. I would say uh, Las Vegas, drinking for Locos, uh, getting stripper cards, and... Uh, oh, yeah, I don't remember too much about the night afterwards, <laughs> but uh, it was <laughs> I drank like four Locos, four for Locos, and uh, that, was, that was a t- tough time, man. Jesus, uh, but it, it was a, it was a bunch of fun, and Las Vegas was definitely um, I would say the favorite part of uh, of the uh, the trip to the United States of America. Troy B. What uh, asks? What's your favorite four loco? Oh, uh, I think it's the blue one. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what the taste is, uh, but the blue the blue can. The blue can. Yeah, the blue, the blue can. Uh, yeah, I like the blue <laughs> flavor. Uh, I, don't know, I don't know. Is, uh, what is the worst thing that could be said during intercourse? The worst... <laughs> like, I would... <laughs> the like, there, there's... <laughs> no, not the incident. <laughs> We're not going to talk about the damn incident. Give it a rest. But uh, I would say, like, the... <laughs> oh, my God. Um, uh, I was... <sighs> the worst... I think there's a lot of things that can go wrong if you're gonna say something. I would say like something about the the, the girl's mother, like oh you smell it like your mother or you smell like my mother or you look like my sister or something like that. And that could be really, <laughs> that could be really not good for you, herpa herpa. Underbar asks, can I play with you in game and in a dirty way? Oh, uh, hello. Are you a girl? You're probably not. So no, stay away. You stay away. Uh, I would say. <laughs> Play with me. Uh, join my Steam group, and you will be notified whenever I'm playing a game. And I, th- I think that will—that is the easiest way to be able to play with me. And in a dirty way, um, if you're not a girl, I'm sorry. I don't really do that kind of thing. Uh, not even for my subscribers. Sorry. Uh, Bot gamer tag asks, "What is your favorite type of candy?" Favorite type of candy. Um, that is a tough one. Uh, I don't really eat much candy anymore. Uh, yeah, I would say like if I'm if I'm gonna eat anything I'm he- unhealthy, I'm, I will probably eat something like chips or cookies or something. Cookies, that makes me happy. Yeah, cookies, <laughs> that makes me happy. What's your favorite movie? My favorite movie is probably The Rock. From way back. It's it's all right. With the shower, <laughs> the shower scene. Oh, that sounds dirty. Shower scene, but uh, <laughs> when they're coming up in the. The from the uh, from under the showers, they're coming up there and they get trapped. It's a trap, and they get trapped. Epic music. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Lay down the weapons. Lay down the weapons. No, we're gonna have to lay down the weapons, and then everybody dies. <laughs> it's it's a good movie. Sorry for the spoilers. <laughs> it's a, it's a good it's a good uh, it's a uh, yeah it's a definitely a good movie. If you haven't seen it, go look it up. The The Rock, directed by Michael Bay. Uh, x Fate's second question was, uh, and what is the incident? Well, uh, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> How many times have you had sex? I've had sex like bunch of times, like, <laughs> like two, two, 
At least <laughs> once. Two like, and a half. At, le- at yeah, least. That's half time you've seen. I seriously. Now you're. you're no, seriously. You're explaining way too much about this. <laughs> with asks. Uh, do your parents know about YouTube and posting videos? Uh, no, it's a big secret. So, shh. No. Uh, they're pretty fine with it. They, I don't think they understand it all. I've told my dad like once. I, oh, I do this thing, and he's like. Yeah, on them inner tubes, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> you uh, are on them winter webs. You search... Uh, what? Uh, from Jesper Rodin. Do you like parrots? No. <laughs> I, can't, I can't like parrots. No, no, no. They're they're they're, be- they're, they're badass. Uh, no, but they're they're all right, I guess. They're you know they're doing their thing, talking and whatnot, flying around, causing mayhem. I I approve. I approve. Mayhem parrots. <laughs> Goddamn parrots. Uh, Twitwith asks, who is your favorite porn star? <sighs> So I don't. I think it's Sienna West. Is it? Wait, Sienna West. Yeah, it's definitely Sienna West. Or Ava. Wait, I'm gonna write Sienna West. Ava Divine. Who else? I don't know who else. Those two. Those are. Those two are top notch. Go. <laughs> we're just having a conversation, man. Jeez, we're talking about porn and whatnot. It's all good. If you're not gonna like my porn stars, you can get the hell out of here, man. You can go. Uh, when did you get into gaming, and did you think you would be so big on YouTube? Uh, seven years ago. No. <laughs> <laughs> we're making things happen, baby. We're we're doing stuff. <laughs> but okay, now the questions are kind of over here, so yeah, I think we're gonna. I'm gonna round things off here. Uh, thanks for joining and thanks for answering a or answering. Thanks for asking a lot of questions and hopefully you enjoyed watching. And uh, yeah, uh, thanks for thanks to the guys uh, for joining for joining the uh, the uh, Modern Warfare 2 uh, open lobby. That was fun as well, and I had a blast. And hopefully you did as well. So yeah, guys, uh, my hat goes off to you for joining and staying for uh, for this whole Jesus. A lot of you have, or a lot of you, a few of you have stayed during this entire show, and we've been doing this for one and a half hours almost. That is crazy. So thanks for joining, and yeah, guys, next stream will be somewhere around somewhere. And bye.